Hi, welcome back to my channel and I'm doing a update on my hair. I actually just had two and a half inches cut off my hair and I thought it would be a good opportunity to start whilst my hair's wet. Um, so I have, obviously I've spoken before about the bleached parts of my hair and that's that started to break and I felt like when I looked at my hair from behind, if I had it all pushed back, Sorry, my top's wet from my wet hair, but I can notice that it wasn't as thick and full all the way down to the ends of my hair. Um, so I kind of got that cut off. At the moment, it's still, it's just below bra strap length. And if I bring it forward, it's way, you can see it's like way past my, oh, it's the wrong side, way past armpit length, all the way down there, down to there. Um, so yeah, I'm going to dry it and then give you another look. And I've also got some pictures before and after I had the two inches cut off just to give you more of a comparison to that as well. So this is my hair blown out. It looks a lot more silky and stuff than before and obviously as I told you it comes down just past my boobs and you can see it's a lot um so you can see it's not wispy at the ends anymore it's kind of quite it's thick and full all the way down to the end of my hair and I had the front kind of cut into a bit more so that is my haircut. I'll show you it from the back now. This is just so here is my finished hair. So I went through with the straighteners and um, to kind of try and keep the curl more when I pick up a section of hair that's been blow dried I'll straighten it down to three quarters of the way straighten it down again to three quarters of the way go the full way down and then I'll curl it to make sure that I'm not straightening out that hair at the end continuously to make it dead straight because then it won't hold the curl as well so I kind of only let the straightener pass over that piece of hair once and then once with the curl and that ensures that the curls come out the hair's nice and kind of flat iron but it's curly and it's going to stay that way because before I was always straightening out my whole head and then doing the curls and they weren't lasting so this is kind of more similar to what my how my hairdresser does my curls and when I went my hair's two weeks post relax relaxer and when I went to the hairdressers my curls actually lasted until I washed my hair today I still had kind of slight curls at the ends of my hair so as I mentioned I had two inches cut off my hair I have retained my length and kind of one of the things I really wanted is to have um, the hair around my face cut just so it framed my face more I previously have had a full fringe and I like just wearing the front of my hair kind of coming forward a bit and so it's nice to kind of have that graduated um, out and also as you can see the I toned my hair so the lighter sections and um, they're not looking too brassy but there's a lot less of them because this part these parts of my hair they kind of really breaking and so I had um, quite a lot of the blonde has been cut out when I first had um, the blonde put in my hair it was all the way up to my roots so this is kind of all this brown hair is new growth and I'm just going to continue to let it grow out I did know that there was a possibility that it would um, well no I knew it would eventually break but I was just kind of biding my time to kind of when that would be and obviously quite a lot of my hair has been able to grow out before that happened um, and it really just it was a good move 
for me just to get the blonde kind of parts on the underneath of my hair because I've been able to retain my length even though that parts those parts of my hair are breaking and I'm just so glad that I didn't decide to dye my whole hair blonde or get any like crazy highlights through the whole of my hair so yeah I've lost two and a half inches but I'm my hair's looking thicker and fuller than than ever um I don't know if I'll be able to see immediately from like another video but I definitely think my hair's in better condition now um and I was starting to like I like the bohemian kind of look but um I've been joking that I was less boho and more hobo because my hair was just getting so straggly at the ends and stuff like that it was like really long but it wasn't um in the greatest condition so I'm really really happy with my hair at the moment and um I hope I've talked about the reasons enough like so basically it was the blonde was breaking and so I was getting it cut but instead of I was getting a trim but instead of just getting a small trim I got two and a half inches and I do have a before and an after photo of how much hair actually was cut off my hair but also maybe I'll put, I'll take a selfie now and then I'll be able to um, do like a finished curled hair before and after shot as well. Um, thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next video.